let's talk about sonnet today and uh, let's have first the main characteristics sonnet is a 14 line poem and it is in iambic pentameter second thing it is carefully patterned rhyme rhyme scheme it has third thing is very important it was in it was invented by la copa da lantini if i pronounce it correct you can pronounce as you want they in the first half of the 13th century so if uh, somewhere is written a sonnet okay it belonged to 13th century okay and uh, it was brought in england by sir guys thank you so much for your visit to our family we need your support and love please press subscribe button and bell icon it's totally free good luck for your exams now and sonnet has two types first is petrarchan second is shakespeare uh for further discussion we can uh, take petrarchan sonnet it has an octave rhyming a b b a a b b a and a sestet rhyming c d e c d e and or you can uh, take it as c d c d c d all right so sestet means the group of six lines octave means group of eight lines eight line ka octave six line ka sestet तो ये बन गए आपके 14 लाइंस, ओके नेक्स्ट थिंग इज अ टर्निंग पॉइंट एट द एंड ऑफ एट लाइन आपको पूछा जा सकता है कि कौन से सोनेट में आपको टर्निंग पॉइंट मिलता है सो एट लाइन में आपको टर्निंग पॉइंट मिलेगा इन पेट्राकन सोनेट एंड इन नाइन्थ लाइन इज समाइम्स इंट्रोड्यूस्ड बाय द वर्ड लाइक एंड इफ सो बट येट सो यू यू शुड रिमेम्बर in ninth line you can have the words like and if so but and yet petrarchan sonnet uh, has octave and the octave has a particular purpose what is the purpose it introduces a problem the poet describes his being struck with a sight of his woman it can be a problem express a desire and reflect on reality and the last one is present a situation that causes either doubt or conflict in the poet so these are uh, the purpose of the first one the the first part octave the second is the first quatrain introduces the problem and the second quatrain develops it okay so this is the information about uh, petrarca sonnet it has octave it has sestet The beginning in the sestet is known as volta. So remember this word, volta, volta. Fourteen line volta in Petrarchan sonnet. Okay, now fourteen line for sonnet. You should remember. So volta. What is volta? The beginning of the sestet is known as volta, and it introduces a pronounced change in tone in the sonnet after eighth line. All right, you will get it. The sestet's purpose is to make a comment on problem. or to deeply a solution to it so means in eight lines you will introduce a point uh, sorry you will introduce a problem and uh, in six lines you will uh, you will give a solution to the problem so this is all about petrarchan sonnet let's talk about shakespearean sonnet now shakespearean sonnet has three quatrains rhyming a b a b c d c d e f e f so are you getting my point a b a b c d c d e f e f okay and a couplet rhyming e e couplet if you don't know two lines you will have and it is rhyming these both are rhyming lines a turning point at the end of the eighth line same as as uh, we had in petrarchan sonnet petrarchan sonnet mein bhi hamare paas mein same the ki eighth line mein hame kya mil raha tha turning point mil raha tha yahan bhi hamare paas eighth line mein turning point hai ninth line again Uh, it is uh, introduced like and if so but yet or not you can get in the first part you can uh, check out this okay the first quatrain introduces an idea pehle quatrain mein kya kiya jata hai ek idea bataya jata hai okay my, when my love swears that she is made of truth i do believe her though i know she lies so this is uh, the the idea <clears throat> this was this second quatrain complicates it in second uh, quatrain poet will write down uh, something like and it will complicate it and in third quatrain again 
complicated and the final epigrammatic couplet resolves the whole thing okay means in couplet like in shakespearean sonnet or in english sonnet you will get the the solution to the problem okay in uh, in petrarchan sonnet you got solution in the sestet and in octave you got problem and in shakespearean you get uh, the solution in the last last couplet okay let's have a comparison let's have a comparison like petrarchan what is petrarchan sonnet what is shakespearean sonnet 14 lines in iambic pentameter 14 lines in iambic pentameter okay both have 14 lines second division in two sections division in four sections in shakespearean uh, sonnet remember this one here are two sections octave sestet here are three quatrains we have and a couplet rhyme scheme is uh, quite different i have already told you okay so you can check out all the whole the video you can uh, watch again you can make your notes and i hope it gonna help you so we will be talking about sonnet in depth again in another videos but till then you should know these facts about sonnet so bye bye take care see you in next video